send, receive and pay money for medical treatment through a mobile health wallet on their phone. And it's every farmer's dream to produce great yields. And if there are methods or approaches that the farmer can adopt that are cost efficient and increases productivity, most farmers will go for it. Farmers are now being introduced to smart water solutions like solar pump and drip, drip irrigation kit, which are more efficient compared to the electric and gasoline pumps. On this week's episode of The Next Frontier, Philip Ketani visited a farmer using this new technology and tells us more. There is no disputing the importance of agriculture to Kenyan livelihoods and our economy. Agriculture contributes approximately 28% of the GDP, employs 75% of the national labor force, and accounts for 65% of the country's total exports. For Kenya to realize its Vision 2030 goal to increase agricultural production in the face of the country's low water endowment, growing population and changing climate, it must focus its attention to two sectors of great contribution, that is water and smallholder farmers. A smart water for agriculture project has an objective of increasing water, object, uh, water productivity to 20,000 small and medium scale farmers within the country within the next four years. With close to 90% of the country being arid and semi-arid land, highly variable rainfall patterns that are even further exacerbated by climate change, and growing number of water-intensive economic and agricultural activities, water management in agriculture is a big challenge in Kenya. At the same time, the country houses immense opportunities for irrigation and agriculture water storage for which only 12% had been developed by the end of 2013. To realize this huge irrigation potential and face the challenges ahead, there is a need to invest in smart water solutions for agriculture. We are looking at smart water solutions or solutions that uh, increase water productivity, efficiency and the cost. One of the technologies we are hoping to market to the farmers is the increased storage or better storage of water. Areas that receive minimal or no rainfall require water to do their farming and farmers use irrigation to water their crops which require water pumps and drip irrigation models to reach all the crops. <laughs> Dutch development organization SNV has launched the first smart water for agriculture program for Kenya, which will help increase water productivity, income and food security by developing climate smart and market-led smart water products and services. Our pump is run purely on solar of between 100 watts to 400 watts and uh, it can be able to deliver up to about 18,000 liters of water on a day, assuming six to seven hours of good sunlight. This six million euro for a year program is aimed at promoting market-led water management solutions to support 20,000 farmers to increase their yields without increasing their costs. Sora ni economic sababu ni natumia jua na hapa ni mahali ya jua. Lakini hii mashini ya hii ya 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 stima sina kugalimu. Farmers are introduced to these new modern solar powered pumps and drip kits that now help farmers cut their energy costs while regulating the amount of water getting to their crops translating to better yields. With our sunlight pump once you are able to fully uh, once it is fully repaid there is no cost of operation and maintenance. This new solar powered pump goes for 75,000 shillings and is connected directly to the solar panel. However, farmers can still